To kick off the 2010 fall semester, Kane University unveiled a brand new Starbucks coffee lounge in the library as part of a recent renovation that included a student lounge, galleries, and the Human Rights Institute. This Starbucks lounge offers a full array of specialty coffees, pastries, and pre-made food. Students can also access Kane's wireless network while they study or work on papers in the lounge. It's like kind of like going to a natural Starbucks in the store. I like the fact that right at the class I can just walk right here, just pick up a um, grande cappuccino. While many students are happy to see this addition, there is still some criticism on the new lounge. I just went there once, just recently, and it was pretty good. It's just, you know, I guess the employees are news because the service was a little slow, so they're kind of getting used to it, I guess. But um, the coffee was still good. Geographically, both of Kane's Starbucks locations are in two buildings across from each other, the library and the third floor of the Center for Academic Success building. The Starbucks lounge that was located in the Cougar's Den has been turned into a health food restaurant. No other spots on campus offer the same comfortable environment offered in the Starbucks lounge. In fact, most buildings have a coffee vending machine cheap in price and cheap on flavor. Students who have class on different parts of campus must walk if they want specialty coffee. Although some students don't really care for Starbucks. Um, not really. I hear some great stuff about it, but not a huge Starbucks guy. I'm more of a Dunkin' Donuts kind of guy. One solution can be having coffee carts at different locations on campus. It would be more accessible for students and is a cheap, effective solution. Uh, Kane should put one towards Vaughan Ames on the way out, and Vaughan Ames lobby is a nice looking area. I feel it's a high traffic area that would probably get a lot of business besides being in the center of campus. Uh, also maybe towards Hennings Hall or Hutch. They redid Hutch, which is very nice. There's a nice lounge in there. So maybe a nice coffee shop someplace else to spread out the location of people would be a good idea, yes. If you're a coffee drinker and haven't made your way yet to see the new Starbucks lounge, make sure you stop by the library and experience it for yourself. For Kane News, I'm James Rabel.